So there we go. I keep buying calipers, but each one of them has their purpose and their occasion. So here we go in another pouch because these things have little pouches within themselves. So I'm going to just pull them all out at the same time. Here we go. Now here I have because I helped out a friend of mine take out a, a microwave that was built into the into the wall and and he was completely baffled as to why would I have something like this in my carry it in my bag For another file nail file some a little bit of paracord around a pry bar this pry bar has been uh, has seen a lot of use and it's been around uh, around me for many years as well. This is a a uh, the back of a watch. You can cr you can uh, pry this open, but nowadays in in today's environment, now you have um you can open devices like phones and cell phones and things like that it comes in really handy there's nothing that is extraneous in this kit this is a Fiskars scissor wow these guys are really really strong I happen to get a hold of one of those a few years back and I'm sold. This is my Leatherman Rev. This um this this one is in their mid range. It has many different um, different um devices uh, built in. It um it even has and this is why a lot of people like the Leatherman because of their outside knife. Speaking of knives Again, I I carry a knife for utilitarian use, uh, uses, and um, not for self defense. I don't believe in carrying weaponry. Okay, so this is one of the top pouches. This is a soft pouch. There are two of them. One here, one here, and um, this is. A battery bank. Now I'm going to show you this in another context very soon. This is an EDC um, lighter. It's actually a lighter and it has um, a small knife. It has a bottle opener, a corkscrew, and um, it's, it's just very very handy a headlight yes it's pink so what I'm entitled to um, here these are the compressed towelettes it opens up to about this big about about good uh, 10 inches um, 10 inches um, e each each way taking all of these things out at the same time so here we go my uh, tape measure it measures out to six feet so it's very very compact I'm sorry I'm here we go very compact or perhaps I should have had a black um, cloth or a lot of people use the uh, cutting mats for presentations um, this is I carry these because they are inexpensive they are uh, you can buy them anywhere and but they they have uses that the other ones don't I mean I have like really nice um, multi tools but they don't have a light built in this one has a little LED light 
and it has um little 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 things like um small um there's an owl uh, um an actual uh owl in there this is spring loaded so this 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 can work with the other tools and this I have actually used this feature where I um, I want light someplace and this serves as a little stand with that being said the here's another one this but this one has scissors and it has these are very useful I found them to 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 be of great help sometimes sometimes you don't want a big screwdriver you want something small this fits the bill it's it ha it is indexed so it it has like two inches and um and it has um what's that um you can when you open it up you have um up to 11 centimeters and they are all indexed so that way you can use that as a little ruler I have here a lever and um, I'm always building stuff this is a polar heart rate belt a, uh, a chest belt and you use it to um, I, I'm a runner so I I use it to um, to gauge my exercise when I go on competitions I haven't been in a while so I'm still training so um, it's, a, it's a Bluetooth one so a lot of different devices like different treadmills you find in, um, in different places I have some zip ties here some paracord in a plastic a plastic um razor blade yes it does come in handy in this other bag I have some a mosquito netting this covers uh, the upper part of my body mosquito netting yeah Um, I have some heat shrink tube in here, a uh, pair of tweezers with more uh, with safety pins and an extra uh, couple of sewing needles and a little bit of that um, a stick of um, hot glue which you can use a lighter and just speaking of paracord here is a paracord needle you screw you you twist the paracord into the back of this and you can use it as a, as, a, as actually a needle you can thread it through things my right in the rain um, book and um, I have inside another Fresnel lens another uh, flat multi tool and um, wow that's that's about it this is um that those are three three levels of EDC and I mix and match. Um, I carry other things depending on what what is it that I'm what, what is it that I'm doing. I plan out when whenever I go out. Oh yeah, well I'm gonna take this or I'm gonna take that. Last week I went out and I was thinking I'm 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 gonna I'm gonna snack a lot because I'm gonna be walking around a lot. So this is my food EDC I know it sounds strange but sometimes you have to do what you have to do you can't you, you, um, here is I have um, one of those slurpy straws remember those aluminum straw there are two smaller straws w that contain a pair of metallic chopsticks in here a 
again, different types. I have some uh, some beef jerky. Here is a little rubber band. This small rubber band melted somehow and it smeared uh, against this. So I, I'm going to have to take a look at that. Uh, and it kind of... In here, remember, if, if you're out there and you're trying to come up with snacks and things like that, um, there are very small, a uh, few choices for having um, protein. Um, here's an apple cider drink. Um, there's some um, oatmeal in the back, some coffee. Um, what else do I have in here? I have some, uh, oh yeah, some seasoning of different types. I have um, different types in here. This is lemon juice, some mayonnaise, some uh, some grody looking um, what do you call it? Um, mustard. This has to be reviewed again as far as I need to look, go in there and check. I, I keep some sugar. Um, Lara bars, more of those um, Slim Jims, um, peanut butter um, flavor Lara bars, um, some Cliff bars, yes, even Pop Tarts and Sweet Tarts. Because when you are out there, I really don't like having to uh, to go from one one place to the other i don't eat fast food i have not gone to i haven't been to a, a mcdonald's in over 20 years um yes it's been about 20 years since i last stepped foot on a, on a mcdonald's so i don't eat fast food the, the, the worst i m i do is maybe once in a blue moon i can count the times say last year that I went to a um uh a burger place other than McDonald's and the other one. Um I can I can uh, again I can uh, mix and match. Here's another flashlight. This is another pack. Another flashlight. This is a uh, sulfur and I can't even begin to tell you how valuable this is. I ordered this online. It comes from South America. Um, in World War II, this was the thing to have. This is an antibiotic powder. And, um, and again, I'm very accident prone when you are out there and you you don't want to have a wound that is moist and um, I'm not talking about a big gaping wound but um, like rashes and and, um, and lacerations and things that are leave your your skin exposed this here dries it up and is also an antibiotic and this and this here is that's a uh, Baofeng um, 10 meter radio that I have and is on all the time. So this antibiotic um, a powder dries up a, a moist open open laceration, and I can uh, I I have nothing but praise for this. Look it up on the net, and you'll see, and you'll see when you try it. Uh, how uh, how much how 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 much I I can just this is another one this is a um another um first aid kit again I have what is called a crash pack and is um again I cycle also so I pack these crash packs where they uh, is is um is a light trauma kit with um with painkillers and a uh, advil 
Advil or um, I have some ibuprofen. I don't I don't go any heavier than that. Some um, maybe Alka Seltzer. Um, some um, some gauze, some band aids, um, anything bigger than that, and it's like hospital time. Um, I got in an Altoids can. I have I have five dollars in quarters. This is my um, box cutter, whatever. Again, I ride bikes, so I take a lot of these these packs with me. That's that's another thing that was inspiring when I went when I go to um, bike rides. We're talking about the whole entire day out there just pedaling. So uh, you need you need to have your stuff together, or else you're gonna you're gonna be suffering, and it's not fun when you are in need of very basic stuff and you don't have it with you and you are like miles and miles away the only thing is either to call somebody to come and pick you up but you have a bicycle with you or you have to bike back and you know rather than than to than to suffer out there here you have you have one i'm sorry about that we have one one pack or, an, or another so that's pretty much oh I'm sorry I'm going to bring this into into it because I I did say that I wanted to talk about this but this here is part of my of my power power this is a solar panel I have any type of adapter or cable that I would need. Um, this is this, because it is directly built into a power uh, a, a battery. Um, you always have five five volts on tap. Um, more cables. They all plug into that into that box that is built into it. But the funny thing about this is that here, here we have this, uh, this, this, this dollar store purchase that was incredible. You put two double A batteries. In there. And you have a USB uh, port where you can just charge anything. So I have two rechargeable batteries. These are these are um these are um what's that? Yeah, these are um nightcaps. I believe they are. Let's see. These are. It doesn't tell me. Oh, nickel mi metal um. Nickel metal hydride. So. Put these guys in there get the adapter cable that go that that inside here and you can recharge this wow i'm moving around the room i have another solar panel and i'm right now at this moment i cannot find it but um all of this serves to recharge any any one of the devices that I carry around um, on a normal basis now more than ever that I have yet another another tablet so now there's another tablet to charge and yes these guys do charge it very well so even the 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 camera camera cell phones um, anything that I carry around it does provide me with enough power to recharge it and um, so I'm never out of power. So power being nowadays a um, of an important component of the EDCs. So now with that, that's it. Um, please um, feel free to comment, either positive or negative. Just do not be insulting. You can be, you can, you can criticize all you want. You can laugh all you want, 
but please do not insult either one of us because we are very sensitive people including the bird the bird has I, I can show you a video that I that I made with him lashing out because he was offended so um, feel free to to um, to comment you can follow us on Twitter you can um, we don't have a Facebook page because each one of us have a Facebook page however we don't need more to 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 to, uh, to update we have enough problems just updating everything that we do already so um, feel free to comment please subscribe this is no other way for us to know whether you liked it or not or whether you actually want to follow our videos we intend to make more videos um, the, because um, we like we like to be sociable we like to share our knowledge I mean between us we have decades and decades and decades of college so you know um, we like to we like to be tapped for information um, our our shop I'm, I'm redoing a lot of components of the shop so I have yet to come up with a, uh, a shop video um, I'm looking at maybe next month to do a, a, a shop tour because um, there's a lot of a lot of reconstructions that are, that is going on. I mean, um, that's a very important part. There's also a lab, a computer lab, um, a video coming up where we show you how we set up our our media slash computer room, and and it's just for the two of us and. This is where we do a lot of the we we edit the videos. We do a lot of um, a lot of work, um, and we have our 3D printer um, in here. And this thing is a monster. This thing takes up like one 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 third of the room. So, and plus we have a lot of monitors over there because the the the, the house. Uh, where we are is flanked by many other places that, that we like to keep an eye out because there's a lot of uh, burglars. This is not a bad area. People from bad areas come down here because they think that we have we have more than they do. Little do they know. Um, so with that I'm going to end this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you the next time.